ELI 5, after watching The Wolf of Wall Street I have to ask, what did Jordan Belfort do criminally wrong exactly? Belfort did two major types of white-collar crimes as the owner of his stock brokerage, securities fraud and money laundering. I won't explain the laundering as it's a whole different beast and it's also very clear in the movie how and why it's done. For securities fraud, he used high-pressure sales tactics to mislead average people into buying junk securities and collecting commission or pushing people to buy junk securities which were used in another type of securities fraud scheme, the pump and dump. Essentially, Belfort and his outdoor friends bought dirt cheap junk stocks for pennies per share in total secrecy. Then Belfort told his indoor friends to call victims and have them buy into an amazing stock opportunity, which were the additional junk stocks. The more victims they brought into the scheme, the more valuable the junk stock became. This is the pump. However, before the internet, the victims had no idea what the stock was worth in real time. They just knew the stock was rising through delayed tickers or in the papers. Additionally, the victims could not sell the junk stocks and cash out. Belfort used high-pressure sales to keep them in the game. After all, the only way to sell your stock was to go through the same charismatic guy who sold it to you in the first place. Of course he's going to butter you up and get you thinking about all the money you will make. Now, once the junk stock rose high enough, Belfort would tell his outside friends to dump everything and cash out. This is the dump. The victims would be stuck with a worthless stock because they couldn't sell fast enough. They were left in the dust. Using random numbers, Belfort would get 1M shares for $10,000 investment, pump the shares up to $3 per share, and then dump them for a profit. This is fraud. Belfort was not the first or the last to run the pump and dump scheme. Nor did the internet fix it. In fact, pump-and-dump schemes are more prolific than ever in the crypto world. 